What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a look at a product that I've been waiting to get in my setup for the last, I don't know, three to four months. These are the Edifier M4 Studio speakers. Uh, I gotta tell you, these are gonna look really, really good in my setup, but I'm also excited to hear the sound quality these can deliver. They got sent to me by Edifier themselves, so thank you Edifier North America, whatever the branch is, for sending these out. They cost $129. You can buy them either in white or black. Those are the two colors they offer. And it's very rare to find good speakers in white, in my opinion, unless you're spending like five to $600 for $129, I think these are really good price, especially for the look and the design that they look at. Uh, they're not too big in my opinion. You know, I've seen bigger speakers and smallers. This is my head. This is the speaker next to it. Uh, pretty decent size, so you wanna make sure you have room for them. Obviously, you can mount them on the wall or you can put them on stands right beside you. Uh, these speakers have two modes. You can either use them as monitors, so when you're doing uh, audio stuff, these are really good for monitoring audio, or you can just listen to music. So you can use the audio dial to actually toggle between the music or the monitoring mode. On the back of the speakers, you have the obviously left and right, active, passive. On the top of the back, you get two knobs, one for the low, one for the highs that you can control, and they give you also the cable to connect to your PC or to whatever device you need to plug into as an input it uses RCA cable and you can connect this to a mixer or to the sound system via TRS connection obviously as well in my setup we're actually going to be setting these right beside my new monitor so they're going to be at ear level perfect for hearing for listening for editing for anything that I'm going to be using them for so without further ado let's set up these in my setup and uh, listen to some good music and see how they sound what kind of quality they deliver I honestly don't know what to expect I haven't bought studio monitors in a long time uh, but I'm honestly excited I'm excited to see what $129 sounds like in these days. So let's do that. Okay guys, so we have the speakers right behind me. The setup obviously took like a couple minutes. Uh, a couple things that I've noticed as I was setting these up, some things I liked a lot, some things I did not like. I really like the way they look on my desk. I mean, there's just nothing that can beat that look. I love how clean they look as speakers. They look better than my Xbox Series X, which is wrapped right there. I don't know, I like the personal way they look. Sound quality, they sound super, super crisp, super, super clear. Uh, one thing that was lacking kind of in my opinion when it comes to sound quality is the bass was very, very like subtle. Uh, and But that was one thing that, because I, I personally like bass uh, when I'm listening to music. The other thing that was a little bit off when I was trying to plug in the cables between each speaker, you know, the red and black wires, they kept coming off loose. Like the holding, the thing that holds the wire in is just not strong enough. I wish it was like a screw kind of type, you know, where you just screw it in. But those are the only two nitpicks that I had in my mind. Other than that, the sound quality sounds amazing. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you, Edifier, for sending these speakers over, and I'll see you next time. Bye.